Hey, this is Dr. Infinity. This is going to be a 15 second intro. One, welcome to White Pill Media. Two, this is a short compilation of Rogue and Cyclops from X Men Evolution, which I recently watched. Rogue's really cute. I really wish they were a thing in the comics. Anyway, enjoy the video. Yes. You perform on Tuesday. Uh, hey, you okay with this? I'm not afraid of you. I didn't say you should be. Just tell your weirdo friends to keep their distance this time. <sighs> Like me, Kate? Pardon me, moi? I cannot tell what is like me. An angel is like you, Kate. And you are like an angel. <laughs> the girls are right. You are a charmer. Look, I'm just reading the lines, okay? Yeah, I know. It's just sometimes I wish. Yeah? Wish what? Wish I could get close to somebody. But you know what happens when I do. Whoa! Tend a moment here? Uh, sorry. Tie that down over there. Got it. This trip ought to be fun. <gasps> Principal Darkholm! He's never going to be your friend. You know that. Who, Scott? I ain't interested in him. Really? Tell me, dear, have you forgotten how Mr. Summers and his friends attacked you? No, it's just that no trophies for second place. Listen, just hang on. You're gonna be okay. You're gonna be... Oh, man, we're gonna die. Here you go. <laughs> Thank you, Jason. Thank you, Jason. Ugh. Come on, Rogue! Get with the program! Shake that thing! Hey, she's got her moves, I've got mine! Yeah, girl! You gotta go with it, you know? You're like a walking zombie or something! Hey, listen, Rogue! How about you shed them gloves and give K-Girl a tiny tap? What? No way! Listen to me! Just enough to rip Kitty's moves! Might work. Just concentrate on them. Okay, but you better not, like, lay me out. <gasps> uh -oh. and that was like pretty ixum am i talking like her okay let's get on with it action looking good looking good Thank you, Principal Kelly. And uh, I want to thank all of you. Yeah, Jean, ride that popularity train for all it's worth. Why is she looking at me? Hey, Moody Girl, what's eating you? Where I'm from, people like me never party with people like them. Yo, Dunk! Whoa. So what, you're just gonna take off? Yeah, I'm pretty much done celebrating Jean's popularity. Know what I think? You got a little thing for Scott Summers. Uh, I am not. I'm out of here. But then I realized something. What? that she'd do the same thing for me. Believe it, Rogue. We all would. It's sure gonna be lonely around here when all these guys leave tomorrow. Yeah, really. But it could be fun, you know? Just us, the prof, Mr. McCoy. Hey, I got something for you. I know it's early, but everyone else is exchanging gifts today. Oh, Rogue, uh, thanks. Gee, I, I haven't gotten you anything yet, but... Don't worry about it. There's still time. Go on, open it. Mmm, <laughs> this hits the spot. My hands are freezing. And <laughs> this angel guy sounds pretty cool. Yeah, but I think the chances of finding him are pretty slim. I know, but at least we got out of the Institute. Hey, let's do something fun while we're here. What do you say? Okay, sure. What did you have in mind? 
Well, I saw this cool music store on Fifth Avenue, and you do still owe me a gift. <laughs> okay, that'll do for starters. Although shopping isn't exactly my idea of fun. Rogue. Yes? These people we talked to today, they really believe this angel is for real. Do you think... I, I mean, is it possible that... Come on, you don't think... You do. Oh, wow. Wow. Um, Scott, I'm sorry. I didn't mean... Yeah, you're right. When I was a kid, after the plane crash, I thought I'd lost everything. My parents, my brother. I just couldn't deal with it, you know? So I believed for a long time that Alex must be out there somewhere with a guardian angel looking out for him. And after a while, I finally grew up. But when we found Alex again after all these years, I kind of wonder if maybe somebody was looking out for us after all. So did you ask him? To the dance? No. You know what everyone around here would say? Who cares? Hey, have you asked Scott yet? You'd better hurry before Jean moves in. Listen, the last time I danced with a guy, he nearly ended up in a coma. But Scott knows. He won't touch you. <laughs> no touching? Sounds like a fun way to dance, huh? I think I'll pass. Looks like you just lost your shot, girl. Scott just got snagged. Doesn't matter. I wasn't going anyway. <laughs> For despite their fearsome powers, most mutants look like normal citizens. Normal? Look at me. I look fat. Do I look that fat to you? Shh. Pipe down, would you? We're trying to keep a low profile. Well, I'm not buying these cupcakes.